Good Friday morning, everyone. Meteorologist Stone Schaefer here with your June 2nd one-minute forecast. And today at Roosevelt Park Zoo in Minot, while they're having Military Appreciation Day, it'll be free admission uh, to the zoo and to other activities around the area and a free lunch at the zoo. Uh, with military ID throughout the day that opens up at 9 a.m. and we actually have some nice weather once again through the morning into the early afternoon before we'll see uh, some isolated thunderstorms start to show up uh, throughout the afternoon but gonna get up to the mid to lower 80s today uh, a nice sunny day uh, winds may pick up though at some points but nothing that's gonna go ruin your day uh, SBC outlook showing a non severe thunderstorm threat throughout the region once again similar to what we had the last really whole week uh, we'll have a chance of maybe some small hail, uh, heavy winds, heavy rain as this thing does uh, start to develop thunderstorms this afternoon. Uh, precision cast is going to show we stay dry throughout most of the day into the early afternoon. By late afternoon we'll actually get some of those isolated thunderstorms across pretty much all of the region start to pop up. Uh, clear out quickly during the night into tomorrow morning. We stay dry midday tomorrow. By Saturday afternoon though we'll see more of these isolated thunderstorms once again. And then we get to Sunday uh, dry in the morning and we continue this pattern on isolated thunderstorms in the afternoon. Looks like it could stay relatively dry out west, but I'd imagine you're still going to have a chance of some of those thunderstorms popping up. We get into Monday a dry morning with another uh, chance of those uh, uh, thunderstorms through the afternoon, and that trend continues into Tuesday as well, maybe more into the central and western portions of the state, and your 10-day temperature trends got us in the 80s all the way through the weekend into the most of next week uh, and of for next weekend.